hello everyone this is asmr if today welcoming you my new tutorial uh, illustrator tutorial and today i'll show you a special technique uh, which one is totally special and uh, about the image tracing okay uh, okay let's see at first go to the file and then new take a new artboard which is uh, 1920 or 500 by 500 you can take a thousand by thousand whatever you can tell okay hit the create button you'll get a new artboard and after that go to the file and then open and then take a portrait this one is portrait i downloaded from the uh, internet and i'll give you the download link of this image okay today's tutorial is especially for that uh, one thing is that this one is the pixel graphics or raster graphics and i want to make it in a vector graphics this one is too much easy and uh, for the very much efficient for your design if you want to make it uh, suppose you want to print this one in your t-shirt or other things you must have to make it in a vector that's why image tracing is a special thing and uh, amazing thing in illustrator okay at first you have to select this one for this work you have to customize your artboard or work space uh, into the tracing and you'll get these additional layers or windows okay at first select these images and turn on the preview options and from the tracing options you have to select the high faded photo suppose this one is faded photo uh, it will take time to just analyze your things okay and automatically it will just make vector if you press the expand option okay you can just reduce the noise okay no need to add noise that's why i'm making this one okay like that i'm zooming this one if you want to make it cartoon you can do that easily you can add paths okay this one is making paths okay this one is like a paint but if you zoom it out it will like that okay uh, if you need corner you can make it corner easily it's fun actually you can play with it uh, this one is amazing for you okay it's like a cartoon image okay cartoon but if you add noise what is happening up there okay, let's see what is happening up there okay path smooth curves filter okay that means it's look like a cartoon but i don't add noise okay okay it's taking time actually it's more smooth okay paths you can make it high it's taking time when it's working okay but if i give the paths low what is happening let's see it's like experiment okay you have to give path like that 65 percent i'm showing you all the options here okay and corners you have to remove the corners i'm making it zero and if i remove the corners what will happen it's better i think paths give like that okay that's good colors if you need to add color you can give it like that okay nice but i think this one is good if i analyze this one it's totally cartoon so i have to give the colors more 
if you add colors it will work it will be more natural okay this one is natural like well paint okay uh, full down automatically if you give automatically it will just initial pixel customize path smoothing it will automatically look like that but i don't want to do this automatically full tone i'll give the full tone and it will get the tone in uh, full options okay that's nice and color or grayscale black and white whatever you can do and the tracing result tracing you can just uh, image source uh, you can watch and custom here high faded photo and i'm giving the high faded photo what is happening when i am giving the high faded photo okay it's working okay okay this one is almost same but some just difference okay after that you have to press the expand option if you press the expand option it will be a vector okay and then ungroup this one after ungroup this one you can reduce this portion this portion carefully you have to delete the portions okay okay like that okay this one is vector now you can work with this vector you can print it out on your mm, collaterals or other things okay it's vector not pixel it's fun when you are working with the vectors uh, and this one is the basic technique actually to make the pixel or raster graphics to vector graphics it's uh, uh, for you and uh, this one is too much useful this one is useful for your work you can easily this one print out on your t-shirt in your collaterals or other things it will give a proper color to you you can uh, take just uh, you can add other things suppose you want to add color or other things you can do you can customize the color suppose this this portion you can change from here okay you can make it blue or other things uh, it's nice okay this one is the basic thing to make raster graphics to to vector graphics What's the benefit about um, the pixel graphics to uh, or pixel or raster graphics to the vector graphics? Pixel graphics is uh, that like uh, that's not accurate format to print out. But raster graphics, vector graphics, uh, the vector graphics is perfect for the printout, and that's why sometimes we need to make. Mm, raster graphics to vector graphics this one is the basic thing to make raster to graphics okay thank you so much thanks for watching my video tutorial don't forget to subscribe my channel and share with your friend till the next video i am signing out and bye bye